because the police and the WSB need to know that Stavros is alive. The best thing you can do for Lulu right now is you get some rest, okay? You let yourself heal. I will tell Anna everything she needs to know about Stavros. Well, you can tell her that the lab is located underneath the main house. Oh, oh. She can... Of course it is. Why would she do something different? Wouldn't it be nice? Maybe she set up this shop in a nice high-rise that's accessible somewhere instead of that remote, stupid island. All right. Love you. Well, hey, hey, hey. T tell Commissioner... If she wants to interview no, me, then I'm, I'm happy to. I'm tell her to... that you were suffering from a gunshot wound and you need to rest. Will you let me know if, if anything changes with her? You lie there, Nicholas. You do nothing. Do you understand that? Alexis? Yes. Thank you. I am so grateful that you're safe, Nicholas. I just hope everyone else is, too. Nicholas was very specific. Stavros is alive. He's taken Lulu, we believe, to Cassadine Island. Yes, but Nicholas just regained consciousness. Couldn't he have been confused? I, I mean, literally, I was just briefed on your family history. And, and the record said Stavros died in 2001. You did the records tell you that the body was never recovered? Because the body was recovered by Helena, still breathing. Obviously, she nursed him back to health, and now he's even more deranged than ever. He's taken Lulu, he's fixated on her, and Mommy wants to make sure her little baby boy gets everything he wants. So she's his accomplice now? No, she's his enabler. Actually, she's the more capable one. He has the penchant for extreme violence. It's a lovely combination. Yeah, okay, but, like, why, why didn't Nicholas tell anyone that his father was alive? I don't understand that. Because he thought that he could learn more if he stayed close and pretended to be loyal, but he couldn't pull it off because he is the one Cassidyne in a countless generations that seems to have a soul and a conscience. Oh, come on, you've got a soul and a conscience. So do your daughters. I don't count. I'm illegitimate. Okay. No, I'm talking about the purebred Cassidyne. Or I should say the inbred Cassidyne. Stavros wanted Lulu. He took Lulu. He doesn't care what happens to Lulu. And if anything happens to her, Nicholas is never going to forgive himself. Just got this from the enhanced footage. You sure? All right. I, I need to know when you get word. Yes. Thank you. Good. Oh, Alexis. What? You are not going to believe this. Tell me. So, that was the Bureau Analyst, all right? And they've been working off this enhanced footage from the satellite imagery that they have of the Haunted Star. Now, there were three bodies on the deck. They have just tentatively identified one of them as Helena Cassidyne. No. There is a mistake. No, the, the computer positively ID'd her. The only reason that they're saying it was tentative is because they haven't recovered the body yet. I have to... Helena is dead? Yes, that is what they're telling me. Oh, well, they're wrong. Because a nuclear bomb couldn't take that woman out. She's too evil to die. No, 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 no. Well, this, there's got to be a decoy, something wrong here. No, I, trust me, I, she I, always comes back, always. You can't cheat death forever. Not even someone like Helena. I would have to see her cold, lifeless, shriveled up body with my own eyes. And even then, I wouldn't believe it. All right, well, until that can be arranged. You know, the WSB, they identified another man leaving the ship. Dante. No. It was Ethan Lovett, Luke's son. Ethan Lovett? Mm. Why would he be involved? I have no idea. Anyway, he managed to make it safely to a passing cruise ship, and so the Bureau's gonna pick him up and question him, but... Okay, so what, what, what about Luke and Laura? Yeah, good news there. They picked up their RFID signals, and, and Dante as well. They're on Casadine Island. She doesn't belong... WSB, interview Ethan. Will you pass the information along to me? You will know as soon as I do. Thank you. I know that Nicholas will be relieved to know that his parents are on the island, but anything about Lulu? Nothing as yet. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I, I need to talk to Olivia and Sunny. Is that okay? Thank you very much for helping, and I'll be at the hospital if you need me. Yes, thank you. Did you speak to Anna? Yeah. And then she passed the information on to the WSB, and they have an update. Apparently, Ethan Lovett was seen leaving the ship he, on a launch. Ethan Lovett? Why would Ethan be involved? He could have been working with Helena or your father. Mm. No, they, they confirmed they saw Ethan getting onto the cruise ship. Knowing him, he went straight to the casino and started fleecing the passengers. But in any case, after they interview him, we will have some more information. Oh, fi okay, fine. What about my mother, Luke, Dante? In Greece, on the family island. And let me know when you have an update from Anna. Of course I will. I love, you. I love you too. When I come back, I'll bring you a cupcake from Kelly's. If your nurse will look the other way. I'm sorry, did you say something? <laughs> so, feel better? You have no idea. My 
now, Luke, Laura, and Dante have reached your sister. They're gonna stop your father. You have nothing to worry about. Thank you for being with me through this nightmare. Please, where else would I be? Thank you. 